Hi, I'm Jennifer Burke and welcome to Living Vancouver, your guide to the good life here on the West Coast. And today we are at Granville Island, one of our favorite places. We're in the net loft section. It's a great place to find some arts, some crafts, and even some clothing. And you know, Vancouver's diversity is reflected in the clothes we wear. And it's not unusual anymore to see people from all cultures wearing different outfits from their respective regions. Well, we thought it'd be a good time to try out some South Asian outfits and everything from over the top to traditional. Here's how it turned out. Gorgeous colors of saris. And we're here with Ronnie Kara. You're the owner of? Crossover Bollywood Say. Crossover Bollywood Say. What does that mean? Crossover, the name came up because we're basically saying crossover to the other side of the world, meaning India, mm -hmm. and all Bollywood movies inspired clothing that we have in here. These are all from India, top oh. designers. People usually ask what are the fall colors, what are the winter, winter colors, but if you look in the store, we have every color. <laughs> wow. Have you so. ever been to a party, Ronnie, and someone's wearing the exact same sari as you are? Not me, thank God, <laughs> because <laughs> I didn't think so. <laughs> because we do exclusive work yeah, here. Yeah, so they, yeah, they seem one of a kind. I they have to are. Say. Every piece is different, and it's only one. And you're gonna find me a sari that works for me. That's right. It's all about the blouse because if blouse fits, yeah, you're good to go. This isn't covering my stomach, Ronnie. <laughs> I'm a little don't, bit concerned. Don't worry, Jennifer. Okay. We will, we will cover this. Stomach. But it makes a pretty sound when you jiggle it. <laughs> <laughs> all right, here we go. Okay. Ready? <laughs> This is what's going to cover your. Oh, amen. A sari is actually six meters of fabric okay. that is um, draped around the body. Wow. And it can be worn in a, so many different ways. And what's the fabric usually made of? Oh, it could be anything. It could be chiffon, it could be cotton, it could be silk, it could have a heavy embellishment depending on the occasion. Okay, show me some Bollywood moves. <laughs> Come on. We need some music. Music! Yes! I jingle when I walk. Listen, <laughs> I love it. It's great. The styles of saris, it's just the way it can be worn differently. Okay. Like the Gujarati style, it's just the drape. Once the pleating is done, the wrap okay. itself, it can be worn towards the back, towards the front. Mm -hmm. So that's basically the only style difference. Well, I your stomach. There you go. <laughs> Not after I've eaten. Indian women are quite voluptuous. They have the hourglass figure. Okay. So that's why the drape was done in such a tight way so that it accented the hips. Right. The bus line, but then they showed the waist. Saris are, are meant more nowadays for yeah. fancy occasions, occasions parties, yeah. dinners out. Correct. We do carry the traditional sari, but the uniqueness or the trendiness comes into the blouse itself, the way it's um, stitched. Okay. So, and that can be very funky mm -hmm. or it can be very traditional, you know, so that's where the creativity comes in. Anybody from the age of 15, you know, 14 teenagers, they're really adapting to the style really well. I have a 17-year-old daughter who's been wearing it for the last two years as well. She loves them. What does a sari cost on average for a nice one for a party or a festive occasion? They can range anywhere, you know, from a $200 silk sari to the heavy embellishment when you're getting the Swarovski crystals involved. Mm. It could be five, six thousand dollars easily, wow. or even more. I mean, top there's tier, no there's, there's no limit. When you go to India, you look at the overall climate. I find that if you don't have the bright colors, you just blend right in. Ah, so, so earth tones don't earth cut tones it with just don't cut it. You just blend in with the environment. Right. The there pinks and the oranges and the and yellows. It's like watching women all dressed up as, you know, pastries. Why not? <laughs> exactly. Candied goods. Candied goods. <laughs> 